Hello, this is Ben Joy's Game Electronics coming back at you with another video. Today I'll be showing you guys how to take apart a UE Mega Boom 3 speaker. It's pretty similar just to the Mega Boom. It is a little different on the inside and it is a little more difficult to pry open, especially this main part right here. So all the tools, most of the tools that you see in this video will be linked down below. And yeah, let's get started with the disassembly. We'll first start off by prying this side open with the power button and the Bluetooth button. For that, we're going to use is just a flathead. All right, so once you take apart this, as you saw, that was very difficult. Once you take that off, then there's these four Phillips head screws, and these just are the Bluetooth function to turn on, power off button, stuff like that. So we'll just take this board off. Now, as you can see, once you take the screws out, this just comes off really easy. I usually leave it in here with this, so just like that, just put it away for now. As you saw when I was taking this off, I did use this for a little bit because it is kind of have to finick with it. It's really hard to get off sometimes because the glue on here is pretty strong with the clips as well. So, but yeah, there we have it. We have this off now and we'll take it put it over there and the next thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna take off this side and pretty much do the same thing it's on clips and some glue so we'll just use the flathead or could use this as well and this will be down in the description down below so let's get started with this now Should just come off just like that. So now we have this and this off. Next, what we're gonna do is take off these two screws. Here we have it, we have that off. That should just come off just like that. And there we go. Just put that aside. Next, what we're gonna do, we're gonna take the whole thing out of here out of this box. So what I usually do is I just push right here where the battery is. Just kind of push and it should come out. Hey, this is Joe from the sauna. If this video brought you value, please support us by buying parts, tools, refurbished electronics, or sending your device in for repair so we can keep offering you free repair tutorials. Back to the video. Just grab it right here. Just kind of wiggle it. It should just pull out. And there we have it. We have it out of the shell. Next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna pry these metal pins right here. We're gonna pry them this way with a small flathead. This will be in the description down below. What we're gonna do, we're gonna start off just right here. Just kind of get in there, just pry it up. And as you can see, kind of went up right here. As you see, just kind of go in there and just push it out. And then grab like a plier or something and just take it out just like that. Put that aside and do the next side and do it for all four of them. There's four, one right here, one right there, one right there, and one right there. There we go. Once you have all these pins out, next thing what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab a metal pry tool, which will be description down below. Start prying on this passive radiator. It's getting held on by some really, really good glue. And then just take this off, these black pieces of tape. Just, you could throw these away. Just kind of pry it straight up, just like this. Should just come out just like that. There's one and do the same thing to the other side. There we have it. Both of the passive radiators are off. Just put those aside and then we're gonna move on to the speakers, which are right here and right here. Pretty much do the same thing, pry them right here. Just pry it up. And 
there we go once we have speaker up be very careful there's a connection as you can see it's right there you're just gonna pull it this way so just grab your finger just pull it and it disconnects just like that then we have it one speaker's out move on to the next do the exact same movement There we go. We have this set off. Be very careful as well with this. There's another connection in the same spot. Just pull it and it should just disconnect just like that. There we go. We have pretty much the passive radiator as well as the speakers out. And next is just the board. And for the board, we just pull it out this way. So here's the battery side and just pull the board this way, just like this. There you go. We have the board now out. Just make sure nothing got damaged. Looks good. And pretty much the last thing now is the battery, which I usually just kind of press it from this side and it should just kind of come out slowly just like that. There we go. This is the inner sh shell right here. And that is how you take apart a UE Mega Boom 3 speaker. As you saw all the tools and everything that we were using, most of it, it will be linked down below. Here's all the parts. We do have some in stock, but they usually run out pretty quick. So if you guys need any parts, it should be linked down below and we should have it available for some time. And yeah, thank you for watching guys and make sure to like and subscribe and comment down below what you guys wanna see next and have a good one. Thanks for watching the video guys. If you guys love what we do, please support us. You guys can click on the links that we have on the end screen. You guys can buy our parts, sales, or service so we can continue to make great videos for you guys for many more years. Thank you.